Hello there, welcome to this in the video and today I'll talk about our download is not working on the shortcut application no more on our iPhone after the iOS 17 update. So if you have used the R download uh, you know, shortcuts and if you start to see it's not working, then here are the couple of steps that you guys have to try to solve your problem. To solve that problem, first in particular, you have to head over to the shortcut application and tap on the R download application from there. And if you say it's not working, all you have to do is just go ahead and I'll uh, tap this three dot line from there. So I gotta wait and tap this three dot line, tap share, tap option, select file, and make sure to choose anyone, tap done, and tap done again, and check whether it works or not. Let's say you have done that, but it's still, it's not really working, then you have to actually re-add the shortcut application on your device. So before you go ahead and do that, open up your settings, scroll down to general, and tap on the iPhone storage. Now, all you have to do, just go ahead and type this, okay? I'll type shortcut. So um, I have to tap this, just go ahead and tap shortcut here, tap upload app, tap upload app again, tap reinstall app. Now once the shortcut application get reinstalled itself on your iPhone, you have to do just these little things. So I just gotta wait a little bit of my time. Once this application got downloaded, open this up here, tap and hold the application, tap delete, tap delete shortcut. Now just head over to your Safari browser and type R download. Um, you can simply type that and you can simply look on Google and you can just add it to the new one to your device. And after that, your problem is going to be solved. So um, once you just add this to your device, hopefully your problem will start to work and you'll be able to use R download shortcut all over again with your iPhone. Now, if you still have anything to ask regarding the R download applications on your device, please do let me know in the comment section. And that is it. Hope you find this video useful, guys. If you think it does help you out in any ways, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to my channel. See you all soon.